Good morning, dearly beloved. We thank God for today too. Today is another wonderful day that the Lord has made. I want to say we may the peace of God that surpasses every understanding be upon your life. I always want to remind you that as long as you live, then God has something great for you. I want to encourage you. There are sometimes when you wake up, situations cause you to be afraid. Whatever that you want to do, you give it a second thought and you say, can this be? I'm here to let you know that the Lord is with you. Do not be afraid. Go forward for the Lord. He is our God. Let's go to the word of God this morning. Psalm 139. Psalm 139 says, O oh Lord, you have set me and known me. You have known my sitting down and my rising up. You understand my thoughts afar off. You comprehend my path and my lying down. And I acquainted with all my ways. Praise the Lord. You see, there is nothing that happens in your life that the Lord does not know. And so sometimes we allow anxiety, we allow depression, we allow fear to just simple come to our way. But the psalmist said, the Lord knows how we're going out and our coming in. The Lord knows what we are thinking. The Lord knows where we lay, the Lord where we live, where we lie down. Where, whatever that we do, the Lord is already acquainted of it. He is aware of it. And so if the Lord is with you and he knows of everything, then why do you want to carry your burden upon yourself, child of God? Let us learn how to carry all our burdens unto the Lord. For we have a burden carrier who is Jesus Christ, our Lord. He has taken away our pains. He has taken away our sorrows. He has taken away our anxiety. So the psalmist said, because the Lord knows everything of me, my moving, my coming, and my everything, then I will learn to give unto him everything that comes on my way. Because there is always a window for us to pass through in every situation. The purpose of the window is that when things become so difficult, we can pass through that window. I am here to let you know that the window is our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Not only has it been a window, but it has been an ajar door, door that is well open. All that you have to do is just look unto Jesus, the author and finisher of our faith, and see the door that is opening. Carry all your burdens and your sorrows unto him, for he cares for you. Why do you cry always? Why do you allow anxiety, fear, depression to hold you? The Lord knows everything of you, so surrender it all unto him and you will receive his peace. May the peace of God that supports every understanding come upon you this morning. You are very special in the hands of God. Never undermine that and demean yourself. It doesn't matter what people are saying because if God say yes, who can say no? If God say you are beautiful, who can say you are ugly? If God say the door is open, who can close it? This morning, speak to yourself and encourage yourself and take away all the burdens and know that the Lord will be with you. Everybody in Kano no Israel, no man any more nyaman no sumau. It's an say, O Kano ho deni na. For adu injune tuno so, no no debe. Shall we pray? Heavenly Father, we thank you for your word that say that you know everything of us, where we lay, where we move, whatever that we do. This reminds us that we should not carry burdens upon ourselves. This morning I pray that anyone who is carrying burden. May your hand take away that burden and give us your peace. That is all what we need. Thank you for doing that.